Welcome to tutorial one, preparing to use Google Maps for routing. First thing is making sure that your, your database or your spreadsheet is right for importing into Google. So let's go ahead and do that. And notice I'm using Google for everything, every single thing. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and, and um, go to a new tab. And for me, I'm just, I'm just going to just click, click on google.com. Okay, next I'm gonna to go to my Gmail. My sister-in-law actually sent me their list so I'm just, I'm, just, I'm just going to simply grab her list from out the email. I'm not going to do anything special to it and just double click on that list. It, Google opens it up. Um, so you can just, you can only view it here, but if I go here to open with, and now I click on Google Sheets, now I will be able to access Google. I mean, this spreadsheet, all, all, all of this here, um, information that she has in here as if I am using um, Microsoft Excel or any other or any other um, um, spreadsheet program that will open up an Excel file. Okay, so as you can see here, we have a lot of stuff going on, um, a lot of stuff that's not needed. So first of all, we're gonna we're gonna clean this up. We're gonna do that by um, um, deleting all these columns that that has no information um, concerning the location or address of of each location. Um, yeah, of each location. So how how do we delete? We're going to click on this A up here in the first row, this A, B, C. We're going to click on A. It was going to highlight that whole column. Then we're going to come over here to H and we're going to hold a shift button and we're going to highlight and we're going to hit on H and it highlights A through H. Next, we're going to right click and we're going to go down to delete columns A through H. Click on it and columns A through H has been deleted. Now our column A is our business name. Okay, and then we have some stuff over here on the right that is not needed as it pertains to the location of our, our um, stores or our stops or route, if you will. So let's go ahead and click on um, F, on delete F through H, hold down the shift, hit H, and it highlights it again and we can right click and we're going to go down to lead columns F through H. Okay, now all of that stuff is gone. Again, it's important that we clean up our Excel file. Okay, and I see that we have an empty column up here. This is an empty row, should I say. Let's go ahead and delete this row. Just, just, just um, click on the number two or on that empty row, if you will. But you have to click over here in, in, this, in this column with the numbers and stuff on it. Um, go ahead and go to right click on it and you want to say delete row okay so now our spreadsheet is clean and it is set so the next thing that we need to do concerning our spreadsheet is we need to save it okay we're going to go to file and we're going to go to download as microsoft excel and just click it and um and just say save file Okay, and it, it saved mine in my download folder of my browser, which is um, Mozilla or Firefox is who I use. You can use anybody, okay? So that's the end of, end of that portion. 